What's up everybody, I'm back here with you for another episode of the Red Dead Redemption. Apologies for the, uh, a short episode. It was a really short episode last, last time. Hopefully I can do a longer episode this time. Let's go on another Jack mission. We're going hunting again. Spare the love, spoil the child. Okay. John! John! What is it, old man? It's Jack. The kid. The kid. Well, I just saw him out in the valley. Seems your tails of hunting got the better of him. He said he was going up to the pass, track down that grizzly that's been seen up there. Kid can't hunt a grizzly. Thing will eat him alive. I know. I tried to stop him. But you're worthless as a lawyer at a lynch. Damn you, old man. This is my son. Anything happens to him, you wish it was you that bear attacked. Alright, let's go. Come on, Lufus. Let's go get this bear. Go and get Jack back. Come on, easy up now. Come on, Rufus. Oh, shit. Did I just let him over? Sorry, Lufus. I didn't mean to let you over. Where's Jack? Come on, find him. Find Jack, boy. He's stopping for. Come on, hurry up. We gotta find him. Find Jack, Rufus. Slow down. Yeah. What you got, boy? Can you smell something? You can find him, boy. Slow up. Slow there. Oh, we're gonna need to come and help us, have we? Let's get that bear. It looks like the deer's gone. Heard we fight the bear, it's decided against it. That'll let you take your chances. On your own. Come on, Rufus! Find Jack! Oh, oh that's. I lost Lufus for a minute then. Find Jack, Rufus! Where's it up here? Up here, Lufus. Jack! Can you hear me, Jack? Can anybody hear me? Let's go! Whoa! Jack, where are you? I've already killed it. Well, telling me to kill the bat. I already have them. What the hell were you thinking going off on your own? You're just a boy. No, I'm not. I can skin an elk, break horses. Come on, let's get you home. When the hell did you break horses? I didn't do that with you. Actually, I already knew, knew how to do that. Just, 
No, no. The bad, I want the skinny. Right? What are you doing? Yeah, I think so. You're lucky to be alive, you stupid boy. What did I tell you about going off by yourself? Well, I go off by myself plenty. You just don't know about it. You're never around. So this is my fault? You disobeyed me. Well, I was trying to prove myself. Prove what? By getting yourself killed? You're always telling me I read too. Please, can we just go home? I never said that. I just thought if I could do something you'd like, maybe you wouldn't go away again. Son, I ain't going anywhere. And believe me, neither are you for a real long time. Easy. What's your mother gonna say? I'm sorry, Paul. Please don't be angry. I ain't angry. I'm disappointed. Don't you ever run off on your own like that again. All right, all right. I told you I was sorry. What would have happened if I hadn't come along? I don't know. I'd probably be dead. You'd be a pile of bones right now. What would you care? I'm just a nuisance to you anyway. That ain't true, Jack. I'd do anything for you. You know that. I guess there's only room for one hero in this family. Trust me, son. I ain't no hero. I'm just glad you're safe. Ah, uh, head bug. Going after a grizzly? What were you thinking? You've only been hunting twice. I'm not a little kid anymore. What were you doing at my age? Bad thing. Things nobody should do. But your mom and me, we didn't have what you had. Yeah, yeah, I know. I should be grateful. I'm not asking you to be grateful. I'm asking you to do what I say before you get yourself killed. It's always one set of rules for you and another set for everybody else. You think I don't know what you did back in the old days? I'm not stupid. You could have fooled me. You think I didn't sit up and listen to Dutch and Bill telling all those stories? You think I don't know who you are? It ain't no secret I didn't get these scars falling over at church. But nobody tells me anything. You and Ma pretend like nothing happened. We just want a better life for you, son. Now rest. We'll have you home soon. Come on! Here we are back at Beach's Hope. I'm sorry I made you worry, Pa. Don't be too eager to grow up, son. Ain't as much fun as it looks. Ain't that the truth? Ready to hunt bears? I'll take you. Discovered the bureau uniform. It will make you immune to all law enforcement. Okay, have we got any more missions on? No. Stop engine. Come on. Uh, that's the engine mission that we can go back to. I, I delivered in the supplies that he needed. That's what I did. Yes, that's what I did now. Go. And uh, while I wait for the new mission. Yeah, let's head over. Th let's head over there. See what this guy's got with, his, with that glider. See if he's got it working yet. <coughs> so 
might just look and stay on my ass. Idiot. Alright. What was it? It's Charles, this guy. You finished your cloudy yet? Person who merely watches the flight of a bird gathers the impression that the bird has nothing more to think of than the flapping of its wings. As a matter of fact, this is only a very small part of its mental labor. To even mention all the things a bird must constantly keep in mind in order to fly securely through the air would take the better part of a day. The bird has learned this art of equilibrium and learned it so thoroughly that its skill is not apparent to our sight. We only learn to appreciate it when we try to imitate it. And I, Charles Kinnear, will now demonstrate the miracle of flight. Into the wild blue yonder, Marston. <laughs> Oh dear. Hey, he's flying. Oh no, he's not. <laughs> oh no. I didn't go well. Is he down there? I'm assuming we've finished that sad mission now. Since he's just jumped to his death. How do you get down there? Is it this way? What the fuck? <laughs> oh, I can jump down there. Come on, there we go. I think you can see it, the glides is there. Go. Can I get all my materials back? <laughs> that I collected for you and you've just gone and chucked your sign off. But where's it? There it is. Get all those little let's save and all that. Where did he go? He must have survived. Survived in a little way. Didn't look like he'd be able to survive that. Ah well. Hey, Uncle Mission's turned up. Great. Got to tolerate Uncle. Head back there then. Wait, no. Is that a waypoint? What the fuck am I doing? There we go. Travel to waypoint, there we go. Let's head back home. Oh, I can't do that yet. Because it's night time. Oh, of course. Right. Let's head and save it. Hey, Abigail. All those dogs and sons. How are you? Oh, now it's not there. No, just a little that until it appears. Yeah. Into black water, I suppose. See how far they get before the, before the <laughs> mission pops up. Pops upon the map. I 
Let's look about it. Is it the explosive rifle to do that challenge? Explosive rifle challenges. Oh, oh, I wasn't even watching the stamina. What the f I don't want to go in the graveyard. What was all that about? Oh, the Uncle Mission's turned up. I think it might be too early anyway, isn't it? 11 a.m. I don't know. Yeah, get out of the way. I think it's the gunsmith, isn't it? The Blackwater gunsmith, the explosive rifle. <coughs> isn't it? Yeah, that is. Explosive rifle. Five thousand dollars. Well, let me take a look. I'm gonna take a few days off and go on the next one. The glizzly that I got after I shot it protecting Jack. So it'll be for me. Sure, let's sell all these. Well, a bit. Well, I make five. I should make five thousand. Shouldn't I? Yeah, I'll make five thousand. What? What's that achievement for? Isn't it make have more than five? Make more than five thousand dollars in cash or something? Well, sell sell five thousand dollars worth of items. Explosive rifle. Five thousand dollars. I'll buy it. How you doing? Good. I got what I need. Do we need to buy ammo for it? Dear sir, hello. I'd assume. If you want the best guns money can buy, you came to the right place. Explosive ammo, there we go. Might as well buy it all. If I can. Oh, this is a the buying and selling that multiplies me just so slow in this game. It's one of the few things I don't like about this game though, so it's not too bad. Alright, five more to go. <laughs> There we go, finally. So what have I got to get do for that then? Kill five enemies who are taking cover with the explosive rifle. Okay. Uh, where's my horse? Oh, what are you doing over there? You're not my horse. Where'd my war horse go? There we go. I want to see it. 
<laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Okay, that's that's gonna be worth five thousand dollars. <laughs> right, the uncle, uncle mission is available. Let's head over and do that. Let's go. Okay, Uncle, what you got for us? By sweat and toil. Okay. Get up, old man. I, I am up. Get up. Oh. Oh. There, I'm up. Thank the good Lord you're back. Nothing worse for an old man than sleeping in the warm afternoon sun. You want a long sleep, Uncle? That can be arranged. It'll cost me less than food. You always was a hard and nasty man, John Marston. And you always was a useless, conniving thief. And where's them cattle? Did you take them to pasture? It's coming around to that. When, exactly? It's easy to pick on the elderly. It's easy, but it ain't dignified. Come on, old man. We'll do this together. Right, let's head out and what we're doing, more herding. Clay. Out of way, uncle. Right, there we go. I'm in position. Right. You stay front. There you go. Come on. What happened to you staying front? <laughs> I can't wait to use the other side of the gate. <laughs> right, let's go. Come on. Come on, cows. Where's the gate there? How can we have got to take them out to pasture? Isn't that what the fence is for? Slow it up now. Yeah. Come on, cows, get going. Oh, missed one. Go. Don't think you're getting away. Come on, Go on. Come on, get going, cows. Come on. Follow the cow on the horse. Well, no, they 
everyone. I think it was like one cow. They weren't lost. Back to Uncle. Has he got back on his horse yet? When will you listen to me, boy? You could have got yourself killed. Shut it, old man. Come on. Let's get this herd moving again. Hey. Let's move him out. Whoa. I don't need to get mad at me, Uncle, just because John's not a player to actually do some work. Slow down. Like you. When is that? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you can watch over these. I'm heading back. You look after the herd. I'll ride back. No thanks. You got your pound of flesh from me today. Get up. Shoot him. Looks like shoot him in the arm or something. <laughs> Don't have to kill him, just. <laughs> just punish him a bit because he hadn't. I haven't washed that yellowy beard. What, what, what even is that? What even is that on his beard? Oh, I've got two missions up here. Let's go. Let's do the uncle mission. A continual. Some Mustangs and some such out there beyond that ridge. Wondering if it was worth getting you and going around some of them up. Fair enough. We're nearly out of money. Ranch is in turmoil. We may not make it through the winter. What could we possibly want with some good quality horses? Come on. That tone of voice ain't so becoming on you. Makes you seem all pent up and angry like some black water would be business tycoon with a bad case of hemorrhoids. I'll give you a bad case if someone just shot me in the head if you don't hurry up. Are you gonna mount up, kid? Yeah. It's actually a good case of being shot in the head. Let's get after him. Let's go. Come on. We're doing. Been breaking some horses, are we? Let's go. Why you got act so diggity all the damn time? Is that a cougar? What are you gonna do? Just look at them horses all day. Damn liability. Well, God forbid I'd do anything around here without checking with His Royal Highness first. Yeah, 
You're real good at watching. That's about all you're good for, apart from bending your elbow. I can't do right for doing wrong. You're an ungrateful bastard, you know. I did my best when you was gone. Your best is like anybody else's worst. Come on. I'm getting old. I gotta start taking things easy. You've been taking things easy for 40 years. Right, come on. Don't shoot me off. Come on. Come on, you'd rather me lad you than uncle. Let me keep you in, you won't have, won't have uncle riding you. Come on, calm down. Calm down. There we go. We got one. Let's go and get ourselves another. How many do we want? Two? Three? End of that. Come on. Relax now. Don't you the same. I won't let Uncle ride you if you come with me. That's it. Come on, come on, come on. Show it. That's it. Careful. That's the Unless you want Uncle to ride you. Come on, calm down. That's it. That's there we go. That's more like it. We're okay, one more. Up. Yeah. Come on, you're gonna lose them. I love that. Let's go. Let's go get one more horse. Ah, oh, missed. On the white one. On that white one. There we go. Finally got it. Come on. Come on, eh. Get in there, there, come on. There you go. That's a feisty one. Don't fall off. Come on. Oh, I'm not gonna get jumped off then. Come on with you. There we go. Walk her over, boy. I think that's enough for now. Let's get him back to the ranch. That weren't half bad for a couple of old reprobates. I learned a few things while I was away. Anything you wanted to know, you only had to ask. You? What the hell do you know about any of this? I was a rancher myself back in the day. Firstly, I don't believe it. And secondly, if you was, why have you been hiding it all these years? You act like I never do anything. I do plenty. You're asleep half the day. The other half you're so drunk you couldn't hit the ground with your hat in three throws. I thought you were a few things <laughs> Like how to steal beer when the bartender's not looking and piss without taking down your pants. All 
Get it up. Look at these here horses. Fine as cream gravy. It sure will be nice to have some money in our pockets. Any money we make's going straight back into this ranch. Not down your gullet. Oh, come on. I ain't working for free here. Ah, there we go. Make sure got there's him. enough fresh hay. We need to keep them strong. All right. Damn, a little gratitude wouldn't kill you. Not a bad day's work. Items are now available to purchase in the stores. Cool. Okay, we got a jack mission by the barn. Next. Come on, easy up now. But unfortunately, that's all I've got time for in this episode of A Lead Dead at Lead Engine. If you enjoyed the video, I'll see you next time. But until then, it's goodbye for now from me.